So, here we are. We've just arrived in this custom challenge map. Hey, Mario, you have one hour to find a hundred ways to die. Good luck. Oh, okay. I've got a really easy one we can start off with. Just jumping off the edge. There we go. Nice. Oh, we've respawned somewhere new. Good job. Every ten deaths, you unlock a portal to a new kingdom. I think he's on about unique deaths, so I can't just jump off the edge like a hundred times to win. What could we start off with, though? We could start off with getting hit by the chain jump. Nice. Oh, okay, the progress bar on the side fills up every time we die. I'm assuming once it fills up all the way, we unlock a new kingdom. You will also unlock power-ups and mods for special deaths. Oh, that's really cool. So if I get any special deaths, I think it's talking about like unique deaths, stuff that's like hard to do. I reckon I can get killed by these guys quite easily. These like, like little fuzzy guys. They have really bad aim. <laughs> They're doing a really bad job at killing me. There we go. And the meter's gone up. The meter's gone up in the corner. I can't die of full damage in this game, but maybe I'll be able to go under the water long enough. I, I just need to stay underwater and then eventually he'll drown. How long does this take? Oh my gosh, it's been like a minute. There we go, nice. And the meter's gone up again. We're getting quite close now. We're about halfway done on this meter. I reckon I can get a 2D death here by getting hit by this Goomba a few times. Come on, Goomba, hit me, hit me. I can stand inside of him. There we go, we got killed by the Goomba in 2D, nice. That was big brain of you to go into 2D. Take the speed power up. Oh, have I unlocked super speed? Yes, I have. Wheel. But I can't actually think of any more that I could do in the Cascade Kingdom. Maybe something to do with the dinosaur? I could try capture the dinosaur. Maybe jump off? I think the only way to get a death with the dinosaur is to jump off. Let's give this a try. See if this works. It might be a repeat though. No, that worked. Nice. I think I can go into sub areas as well. And there's a sub area down here with poison. In this pipe here, there should be an area with poison. Which if I go into... Yeah, there is poison. And poison the one-shot kill. Nice. That's a poison death done. But the counter in the side's gone up. The counter's really close to being done. Maybe I can get a 2D death in the other sub area here. Because there's another sub area with a load of 2D things. Maybe there's like a different enemy. Down here, there's another 2D area. Oh yes, there's a Koopa Trooper. And there's these mini guys. These mini guys can kill me as well. These mini golden Goombas. We're on eight deaths now. We only need two more to leave this kingdom. And there's a 2D Koopa Trooper here, which will be very easy to kill me. Come on. There we go. 2D Koopa Trooper. And maybe if I jump off in 2D, that will count as a separate death. This challenge is so cool. It's got me thinking creatively. If I just ride it down, let's give this a try. There should be a death area. Yes, there we go. It didn't even look like he died. It just looked like he shrunk down. Oh, the meter's filled up now. Oh, okay. Congrats, you've unlocked the next kingdom. And there's a giant painting which looks like it's going to take us to Bowser's kingdom. All right, let's go into it. I think I need to do a backflip up. There we go. Yes, enter. Let's go. Let's move on to the next kingdom. Bowser's kingdom is probably going to be one of the easiest ones to die in. Welcome to Bowser's kingdom. Ten deaths here will be really easy, lol. True, they will be really easy. And straight away, I see some fire over here. Right, let's see if we can get a fire death. All right, I'm down to one HP. Let's get hit by the fire. Like a quick, easy one to start off with. There we go. Another easy one should be to get hit by the spikes here, because there's a ton of spikes everywhere here. There's also spinies. I can get hit by a spiny. I don't want to get hit by the poison. There we go. Spiny death. All right, let's get hit by the spikes. The spikes should be an easy one. There we go. Spikes done. Also, the death bar in this kingdom seems to be a different color, which is cool. Oh, there's these guys which crush you down here. These, like, thwomp looking guys. Come on, crush me. This might be the first time that anyone's ever died to these guys, because it takes them so long to kill you. <laughs> one more time. Let's go. I got crushed. I can also get poked by one of these Pokeos. Come here. Come here. Poke me. Maybe landing on the Pokeo's helmet will count as a unique death. Let's test that out. On the same Pokeo that killed us before. I just want to jump on its head. Might be a bit difficult with the speed, but yes. Oh yeah, that does count as a unique death. Nice. That was clever. Take this. Bruh, it's turned me into Tails the Hedgehog. I don't know how that helps me, but it's cool, I guess. Maybe the flame here counts differently. Yeah, because it makes Mario do this animation instead of just being burnt immediately. I think it worked, but my game crashed. I think I can get hit by these Goombas with really funny looking hats. They've got bowls on their head. There we go. Nice. We only need two more to move on to the next kingdom. But since this kingdom's so big and there's so many different ways to die, I might try to get 15 in this kingdom. With this guy, with this Tanuki Rock Mario, I might just be able to jump off. 
<laughs> he fell so fast. I think there's also 2D poison somewhere. I think in this room. Oh, I have to be dressed up as a samurai to get in. Hey, I'm dripped out. You happy now? Hey, okay, I can get in. And in here, I think I can get killed by poison or the poison in 2D. There we go. Okay, I can jump into this poison in 2D. There we go. We got hit by the poison. Nice. And that's 20. But before I leave this area, I think there's another way I can die in this 2D area. Oh, there's a red Koopa Trooper. I can get... No, I don't, I don't want to get hit by the shell, shell. I could have got hit by the shell. Okay, I can get hit by the red Koopa Trooper and it's shell. Wait, I can get hit by the shell? Go on, nice. Okay, I got hit by the shell. I can get hit by the red Koopa as well. Whilst it's not in its shell. Hey, okay, that's a separate death because the one in the Cascade Kingdom was green. Oh, I can also get killed by this fellow up here, this guy that spawns Goombas. Come on, spawn on the spike ball. Yes, I got hit by the spike ball. Nice. Okay, I can get hit by its spikes now. I think I've, we've unlocked the new painting to the next kingdom. But I want to get as many as I can in this kingdom because there's so many cool ways. That's 24 now. Oh, I can get hit by these bombs as well. I can get blown up. Boom. <laughs> yeah. Oh yes, we have unlocked the painting to the next kingdom. Why did you get so many more? Because I can, Toad. And the snow kingdom will be very difficult to get some deaths in, so I guess I'm, like, stocking up. Oh, where's the Toad? Okay, I'm in Shivaria, the snow kingdom. And to start with, I think we're just going to go into here and get frozen. I want to make sure I don't get frozen and I don't get killed by drowning. I think I froze. I can also get hurt by these Blosive Josephs. Oh, I fell. <laughs> Come on, Joseph, hit me. There we go. I can't actually think of any other deaths that's unique to this kingdom. Oh, no. Oh, these fish. Yes, I can get hurt by these fish here. All right, let's run into them. There we go. I got hit by the fish. If I remember correctly, there might be a 2D spiny in Shiveria. I need to be dressed up for the snow to get in. Bruh. Okay, I've unlocked this room nice. If I go in, I'm pretty sure there's a 2D spiny. If it is, that's good remembering. Yes, there is. I'm actually happy with myself. I'm proud of myself for remembering that. I can just walk in and get hit by the spiny. Come on. Nice. I only need one more, I think, to get the meter filled up. Oh, I have an idea. I'm pretty sure in one of these sub areas, there's falling icicles. Oh, and there's also these guys. He can chomp me. There we Come on. <laughs> there we go. Death by chomping. Here we are, the icicle cavern, where I can get crushed by an icicle. Ooh, okay, it looks like a painting and a toad have spawned in now. Hey, nice one, you can move on now. Hey, thank you, toad. Okay, we can move on to the wooded kingdom. And at the moment, we have 31 deaths, so we have to get nine more deaths in the wooden kingdom. Oh, okay, there's actually quite a few ways to die in the wooden kingdom. Starting off with the uproot, come on, jump on me. I got sniped by an uproot. I believe down here there's also a fire bro that can kill me. The fire bro can actually kill me in two different ways. One by like running into me and one by hitting me with the fire. Fire bro, run into me. There we go. Come on. Nice. Oh, okay. There's also fuzzies down this pipe. All right. I just want to run into these fuzzies. And the counter's half full now. Oh, the tanks. Shoot me then. Shoot me. <laughs> I can also get killed by the tanks by running into them. Bruh, I meant to get hurt by him. There we go. Bonk. Here's a few that I can get. The floor poison. The poison projectile. And just by walking into the piranha plant. Come on, giant piranha plant. I think I can get crushed. Oh. There we go. There's actually another death that you can only get in this kingdom, which I want to get, which actually takes place in the deep woods. It's actually this dinosaur over here. Come on, attack me. Oh, okay. Here it is. The painting for getting to 40 deaths to the next kingdom. Oh, there we go. It's letting me in now. Nice. There's a lot of different ways to die in the sand kingdom, so I reckon this is going to be a really good place to stock up on deaths. Starting off with the cactus. I can just jump on this cactus straight away. I can get hit by a bullet bill as well. And I can also drown in quicksand. That's actually quite morbid. Oh, okay. I can also get hit by a bullet bill in 2D. Come on. And I'm pretty sure down in this sub area, there's like ice things which can crush you. Yeah, there is. Okay. So these ice things here can crush me. I don't know if it's a one shot kill or if it just deals one damage at a time. I guess we'll find out now. 
It's a one-shot kill. Whoa, that looked really painful. If I fall down this hole, there might also be stuff. I just remembered there's a timer. I've only got 30 minutes left on the timer, so I really need to speed up. Okay, there's these fire things that I can activate with Cappy that can kill me as well. Nice. As you can see by the bar in the corner, I've only got two more deaths in this kingdom, which I need until I unlock the next kingdom. Oh, okay, I almost forgot about these fellas, but these fellas here can also kill me, these mummies. Nice. I'm actually kind of stuck. I can't think of anything that would work. Maybe running off the ledge with Jaxie? Maybe that will work? Oh, yes, it is a unique animation, so it might work. Oh, the toad spawned. You reached 50 deaths. You can now use the Odyssey. But you only have 25 minutes left. Oh, okay, okay. I need to be quick. If I've only got 25 minutes left, I'm more than halfway, but I'm only halfway done. That's cool that I can now use the Odyssey. I can go to any kingdom I want. I reckon Mushroom Kingdom's probably the best place to go because it has a load of boss rematches which all have unique attacks. This and the dark side of the moon will be really good. Maybe the darker side as well because that has every enemy. I reckon I, I can also die by running into him. Yes, I can. Okay, when he plonks his head down, he shoots out another load of lasers, and that counts as a different death. Nice. All right, so if I pull out one of these things, these, like, laser fuzzies spawn. Come on. Laser fuzzy, hit me. Yes. I can get hit by all these spiky balls. I can also get killed by the Gushin. I actually haven't been killed by the Gushin yet. Come on, there we go. Oh, there we go. I stunned him. I can uncapture and... I got hit by him. I didn't get hit by his head, but I reckon that still counts. There we go. He's hitting me with his laser. Nice. Let's go to the Lost Kingdom because there's quite a few enemies that are unique to there. I only have 20 minutes left to get 26 deaths. These wiggly boys. I just want to get hit by these 2D fuzzies now. Come on. I reckon the dark side of the moon is a good place to go next. Okay, there's lava here as well. I haven't actually been killed by lava yet, so I may as well get killed by the lava here. And it looks like once I get to 75 deaths, something big's going to unlock. I may as well go and get killed by each of the brutals. That's Rango. That's Harriet. I can't be bothered with any more of these Brutals because it takes so long. So I have to defeat any of them to get to the next one. I have to defeat Topo and all these other ones to get to the next one. So I'm just going to head off to the darker side now. Okay, in the darker side, I haven't been hit by these Potaboos yet, so I can get hit by them. Nice. I've just made my way through the whole of darker side. On most of Darker Side, and I've came to realize that one of the only things I haven't died to are these flies. So if I can get hit, come on, flies. There's so many of you. Surely I get hit. What? How did I not get hit by him? I haven't fell off with Glide on yet, so I guess that counts. Oh no, I, I only have 15 minutes left. That's the flies down. The last way I can think of to die is in this soup here. But after this, I unlock something cool because my meter's nearly filled up. There we go, it's filled up. Nice. 75 deaths, Mod Mayhem unlocked. What is Mod Mayhem then? Oh, all the colors here have changed. That's kind of cool though. I think a load of mods have just spawned, like they've just changed the kingdom slightly. Anyway, I think it's quite smart to go to the underground moon cave in the moon kingdom because they have like one of every enemy here. There's lava beams as well. There's lava beams. Yes, another one. I've only just noticed it, but there's actually Minecraft Mario on top of his head. Oh, here's another new one. Minecraft Steve. Minecraft Steve can hit me with his pickaxes as well as hitting me with his, like, just body in me. There we go. I got hit by Minecraft Steve's pickaxe. <laughs> oh, another way. The Bonsai Bell, aka the Minecraft Wither. Come at me, Bonsai Bell. I can also die by the wither skeletons. Oh, the mutant zombie. The moon rocks. Oh, Madame Brutal's here. I can get killed by a chain chomp. And also by just running into her. Why was he upside down? I've got 10 minutes left. Let's go into the Bowser painting, see what else we can do. I can die by a Bowser's hat. He just punched me in the face. I can also die by just running into Bowser. I can die via his exploding golden balls and by his normal balls. 
I wonder if I get a reward at the end. I can also die by a Bowser's fire, which doesn't actually count as fire. It counts as a projectile. It doesn't actually burn Mario, which is interesting. I can die by not <laughs> jumping over Bowser's attack as well. Nine more. I'm getting really close. Oh, the final one for Bowser is his fireball, his fire swipe. We only have eight more, and one that I could do, which is quite funny, is using the mod menu to just straight up kill Mario. It doesn't give an animation or anything, it just looks quite funny. Oh, I reckon I could get hit by these Minecraft skeletons. <laughs> They've just got black Minecraft people on their head, and these Minecraft spiders. I can get hit by these Minecraft spiders. Only six more to go. I can't wait for this reward. I can't wait. And I can also die to this pink lava. I don't think I've been hit by this pink lava yet. Nice. And magma cubes. There's magma cubes here as well that I can get damaged by. There we go. The magma cube. Oh my gosh. I've got four left, but I can't think of any more. Maybe. I don't think I've been killed by the fish yet. The fish in this kingdom. But yeah, these fish. Come at me, fish. I'm not scared of you. Three more. Three more in five minutes. This should be easy. This should be in the bag. Can Lakitu hurt me? No. There's actually a really funny death that I can get in this sub area here. You see up here, there's a zipper that you're not normally meant to get. But if you do a trick jump, you're able to get it early. There we go. I got it. I got it. I got the zipper. And if I zip it, I just fall. I die. Great. <laughs> I've got two more left, and one can be the Minecraft zombie, which spawns right here. There they are, the Minecraft zombies. Oh, don't run away. There we go. I got killed by the Minecraft zombie. One more. I only need one more death left, and then I will have got to a hundred. Oh, oh, oh. I've got an idea. I've got an idea for the last death. Maybe, maybe if I go in here and do the New Donk City Festival, can I redo the festival? Normal festival. Okay, if I do the festival, I believe there's a 2D way to die. There might be quite a few that I didn't do end up doing. Oh, I'm so dumb. I've been looking everywhere for ways to die, except from here. I'm really close on time. I've got about two minutes left. I've got two minutes left to get this right. Okay, this oil here, this oil here might be a one-shot kill. And there's barrels and stuff. If I stand in here... This is a unique death, I think. Yes! Yes! Let's go! I did it! A <laughs> hundred deaths in Mario Odyssey! You proved that you're really bad at games. Here's your reward, lol. And then it's like five coins. Thanks a ton that I guess. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, you might also enjoy Super Troll Odyssey, which is a really, really cool troll level. Click on screen to watch it now. It's a really good video, and I'll see you over there.